Hey guys, it's Clancy with 1013 Vintage, where we talk quality thrifting and everything fancy. And I have so much cleaning to do today. I need to take a break with thrifting and I am going to organize. I need to upload. If you guys listened to my last video, I have a huge load of inventory that I have to sell because I'm I'm becoming a a hoarder. <laughs> so I am going to I have you guys can't see but I have sections of stuff here. I'm going to take some images of the pre-loved bags that I've um, gotten. Um, aren't these so cute? I can't believe I got these. These are mother jeans. I know I showed you guys in the last video, but these are brand new with tags with a fire flame at the bottom. And the waist is um, 25. thought these are so cute. I'm gonna, um, I need to order some hangers for like pants and, and jeans and what I'm doing now is just kind of just making sure before I photo pieces like this I want to make sure there's no holes there's no tears this vintage sweater that was made in Italy it has like a leather collar leather trim and I think there's leather at the rim of the sleeves. And I thought this was beautiful. It's wool. Um, it is lined. It's fully lined. And I'm going to just make sure that everything is intact. And when I'm photoing, it could really just pick up the colors of this, um, you know, these are the pieces that I look for when I'm thrifting. I, I do thrift just for like regular um, garments um, for myself, but when I'm thrifting for my online shop, I look for pieces like this. Items that you normally wouldn't see um, anywhere. You know, this is all beaded. This is a beaded knit sweater. And it's, it's divine. I love looking for stuff like this. This is pure vintage. It's a pullover knit sweater with sluts on the side. And yeah, I'm going to take some images of these. Um, this is also a knitted sweater dress, vintage, with a, a pillow sleeve. And I wanna say this is, um, this is probably a medium. Let me see the size here. This is really pretty really pretty and you know i have like a magnifying glass that i also use um, when i'm just looking at the details of the beading um, i just want to make sure i'm pricing these pieces um, at the right price only because if there's um anything missing i i obviously would not um expect full value of it so you know, things like this. And it looks like it's like a large tree. Is this a tree? Yeah, it's like branches. And it's slightly beaded. Um, and then I found a, a, high, a, a, a high fashion beaded sequence, little bit of lace. This is brand new with tags. You can tell this hasn't even been worn because this is still attached to it on the outside of the dress. Um, it's by BCBG. Uh, the original price is 
I don't know if you can see it, it's $400. And I always take my time to look for any kind of holes, tears, um, and things of that nature. So yeah, I'm going to upload some of my images. I'm going to, I have a lot to do. So um, I, I've just been thrifting a lot and I haven't taken the time to take photos, upload them, describe them, and sell them on my um, my online shop. Although I've been getting several messages asking to purchase, you're not able to purchase because I haven't uploaded it yet. So I'm apologies to you all. Um, yeah, let me show you, I can show you also, let me show you also my photos that, I, not my photos, my, um, my bags that I'm going to upload. So I have some of the pieces here um, posted on my shelf that I haven't gotten to post all of these, upload, take take really good images of them. You have a vintage Givenchy, um, a Balenciaga bag, vintage Dior, which you guys have see, been seeing these things, but I just haven't been uploading them. For the most part, some of these are um, on the website, but not everything. This vintage Fendi. I looked up with that one. That's the, that's the, um, yeah, that's the, um, vintage doctor's bag. Um, and then I have some really good vintage leather Bottega style, um, clutches that I really love. And yeah, I think you guys will too once I start taking pictures and putting them on the website. So this is my little office area. I have my little pieces here where I have like my business cards. And then I have my, my postcards, my thank you cards and yeah. This is some of the my section.